this video we are going to see a problem on projection of planes for that here we have a question a square plane ABCD with sides 40 mm has its surface inclined to HP at an angle of 45 degree and perpendicular to VP such that one side of the square plane is in HP draw its projections so this is the question in front of us now first I'll draw the XY line VP HP position and then explain what we have to do in this question. So first drawing the XY line. Now it is given that square plane ABCD with sides 40 mm has its surface inclined to HP at an angle of 45 degree. So inclination with HP will be seen in VP and it is given perpendicular to VP such that one of the side of the square plane is in HP. See if one of the sides is in HP it means the complete square plane is in HP that is the meaning that when we are looking from top we are going to see the square plane of 40 mm side. So in the top view I am going to draw it in HP a square plane of 40 mm side Measuring the same distance 40 and marking over here. So, in this way, the square plane will be looking from top. I'll make it dark. So, this is the top view, and in case of planes, if in one of the views we are getting the true shape that is like example here we are having a square plane so it is looking square in HP that is from the top so from the front it will appear as a line because planes have negligible thickness and that line will coincide on XY after that I'll give the notations here then the next condition here if we see this is the front view of the square plane and this is the top view the condition is it has its surface inclined to HP at an angle of 45 degree and perpendicular to VP so if it is inclined to one plane perpendicular to the other plane now I have to make this plane inclined like for example when it is appearing as a line in the front view I have to tilt it keeping AB as fixed and I have to tilt this square inclined at 45 degree so here I am fixing AB that is in case of planes the left hand side will be the reference so fixing the plane on left hand side and then turning the square at an angle of 45 degree it means this line will be tilted at 45 degree Here this angle, I'll say that since it is with respect to HP, so that angle is called as theta and theta is equal to 45 degree given. Next, the length of the plane is from A dash B dash up to C dash D dash. This is the length of the plane, giving the notations here. then making this plane dark which is the front view of the inclined plane now I have to draw the top view because when this line was horizontal it was appearing as a square now since this line has become inclined the shape won't be remaining square so the next shape which I am going to get that will be called as the apparent shape for that we are looking here as an observer so here projecting these points A and D so where this point A and A dash they intersect that will be point A D and D dash that will be point D 
Similarly for B and C, B and B dash, C and C dash. So here I am getting this, these four points, joining them in order. So this is the top view of this inclined square. Now it has become a rectangle. Then after completing it up till here, I'll give the dimensions. Square of 40 mm side. Now it has become a rectangular plane. And this shape is called as This is the apparent shape and here this square it is the true shape and with this we complete the problem.